a very warm welcome to all you are watching CU live your non-stop weekly top news stories from CU and across the globe I am Aarti and let us start the news bulletin with headlines star cast of upcoming Punjabi movie Hai and Diarya performed live at Chandigarh University two teams from CU participated in third senior national gridiron the American football championship 2018-19 Former Indian bowling spearhead and the master of reverse swing Azahir Khan is coming to Chandigarh University. Now national news. Prime Minister Narendra Modi visits Seoul later read at the National Cemetery and paid tribute to the fallen soldiers including those who died in the Korean War. Sports news. The Board of Control for Cricket in India has not prepared any note seeking a World Cup ban on Pakistan. The Pulwama attack has escalated diplomatic tension between India and Pakistan. Now the top stories for the week. Famous Punjabi singer Ninja was live at Chandigarh University. Star cast of upcoming Punjabi movie Hai and Diarya performed at Chandigarh University. Famous Punjabi singer Ninja, actress Navneet Kaur Dhillon, Muskan and director Pankaj Batra interacted with the CU students and shared with them insight on their upcoming film. CU students also did not hold back and enjoy to the fullest. Two teams from CU participated in Gridiron American held at Purnima University Jaipur and backed one gold medal by defeating Haryana by 27-12 and one bronze medal by defeating Rajasthan by 16-0. These two teams from CU also participated in third senior national Gridiron American football championship. It is cricketing time for CU students. Former Indian bowling spearhead and the master of reverse swing Zaheer Khan is coming to Chandigarh University. He will hunt for cricketing talents and will be sharing important cricketing tips with CU students in a workshop organized at CU campus. Now national news. On the first day of his visit, PM Narendra Modi unveiled the bust of Mahatma Gandhi at the prestigious Yonsei University in Seoul along with South Korean President Moon Jae-in and former UN Security General Ban Ki-moon. PM Narendra Modi later read at the National Cemetery of Republic of the Korea that in terms remains of 1,65,000 merits and paid homage to the fallen soldiers. Prime Minister Narendra Modi was accorded an official reception at the Blue House, the executive office and the official residence of President Moon in the Seoul. Modi is visiting South Korea on the invitation of President Moon. This is his second visit to the Republic of South Korea since 2015 and the second summit meeting with the South Korean President. With camera person Rishab, this is Vishali from Chandigarh University. Let's move to the sports news. The Board of Control for Cricket in India has said that there is no way seeking a ban from the Cricket World Cup, which begins in the UK in May 2019. The BCCI and the Committee of Administrators have not prepared any note seeking a ban on Pakistan at the upcoming World Cup and even if such a move is made, the International Cricket Council is bound to reject it, a BCCI official said. Already Pakistani shooters couldn't make their World Cup in Delhi starting on Saturday after not getting the visa. There's a demand for India to boycott its June 16th World Cup clash against the neighbour and this matter is likely to come up in ICC meeting between 27th February to March 2nd in Dubai. With camera person Mayangadia, this is Neha from Chandigarh University. And now here is a look at some more stories that is making news across Chandigarh University. <laughs> Department of Aerospace Engineering at Chandigarh University wishes all the demonstrator good luck for the five-day event. With an aim to provide a significant platform in bolstering business opportunities in international aviation, sector over 300 exhibitors from Indian Defence Forces have begun the Aero India Show 2019 in Bangalore. Chandigarh University, in association with Geeks Up, is organizing a World Lock Hackathon at CU campus. The top 12 winners will get a rare opportunity to go on a fully sponsored 7 days boot camp at NASCOM. Visionary educationist and Honorable Chancellor of CU, Sardar Satnam Singh Sandhu, participated in a panel discussion on the issue of Kashmiri students after the Pulwama attack in leading news channel News 18 Punjab. He presented his worthy views on how to deal with the current situation. 
And with that, we wrap up the weekly news bulletin. Thanks for watching. Have a great day ahead.